Yeah, I did know, like at the beginning of the season, that I had this many points to go, and I knew that if I kept working and we all worked together as a team, that I could do it. So I was like, oh, I'm not going to get 32 points in a game. Well, before the game, they all thought I would get it, of course, because they were very supportive of me. And during the game, they just got me the ball, and I did what I had to do. I don't, I don't know what happened. It was, it was really fun playing. I just kept getting the ball, and it just kept going in, so. <laughs> I'm right-handed, yes, <laughs> yes, I did shoot it with my left hand. Uh, I did know that that was for my 32nd point, which it was really cool how everyone reacted and everyone was cheering for me and I felt so special, like I was just so happy and <laughs> I couldn't stop smiling. I was really tired though because I'd been in like the whole third quarter, so I had to go sit on the bench. My mom had got the sign like a f two days before maybe, and she didn't bring it because she was like, oh, it's 32 points. I don't think she's gonna score that much. She hasn't scored that much in a game her high school career, I don't think. And so she left it at home. And then at, at halftime, I had 22 points. And she was like, grandma, you have to go home and get the sign. She's gonna hit a thousand points. So my grandma, drove all the way to our house and drove all the way to Jeff and <laughs> she didn't think they were going to let her in because she didn't have a wristband but they did let her in and she made it. I got a thousand points like I didn't even think this would happen like it's a big accomplishment. I think my teammates are a big part of it. They they're so supportive of me and I couldn't I could never do it without them. They're just such a big part of my life and my basketball career. We want to put in the work. We want to go as far as we can. We, we really want to go to state, maybe even win. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, that's the main goal.